An unfamiliar space. No sign of the Fraxidus. Chung Li is also nowhere to be seen. I need to find her quick. This is going to be a pretty big missile. No! Don't come any closer! Can I go there? No, I can't go there. Can I go up? No, I can't. This is Chang Li? Is that Chang Li? Yeah, that's Chang Li! This village was attacked by tacit discords. There's nothing left. Why did you come here? No one but the exiles are willing to stay here now. Are you a bad person? That's what all bad people say. Whatever you're looking for, there's nobody here but me and the tacit discords. When I'm here, no one's afraid of me, and I won't hurt anyone. Anyway, you should hurry up and leave. It's not safe for you to be here. Mirages in a Sonaro sphere shouldn't be able to hold a conversation like this. Are these phantoms pulled from Chung Li's memory? Generated by the retroact effect? Huh? Why did you stop talking? Are you lost? I... I can take you somewhere safe. I know a shortcut that leads to a safer village. I want to explore this place. I want to look if anything is there. This is that game. Okay, I could go there. Maybe a loot box. Something must have to be here. I'm missing something. I am missing something. Uh, was there something like this here before? These mechanisms. They need to be unlocked from both sides at once. Okay, okay let's each handle one side. 
I'll go over there. I'm ahead of the game. It's open. We'll be safe once we get out of here. I'm way this ahead of the game. This a bit different from what I remember. I will not go there. Yo. But I want to go there. Maybe Mortify could help me. Let's see. Ah, 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 ah. Sit. Let's do this another way. No, it doesn't work like that. So. No, nothing could be done. I would have to come here. These are the villagers attacked by tacit discords. Why? There weren't any of them here before. Don't worry. My forte is strong. I will get rid of them and protect you. I'm thinking too much. I'm thinking ahead of the game. I need to stop do this. But I see something over here. There's nothing else. There's nothing else. So let's go to that side. Kid. I'm strong, you know. No, it doesn't do anything, so let's go there. Fast, I'll go to the left. Again, got seen. The village I lived in got destroyed by those scary monsters. They hid me in a safe basement. While everyone else died or ran away. 
No one except me made it out alive. When I came out, no one was there anymore. Now, I must get to somewhere safe. Okay. There's a piece of paper. It has turned yellow. Oh. If I had arrived sooner. <sighs> Why everyone is playing this game, I don't know. Remnants of the past. I can't go there. Whoa. I found some dry rations. They look well kept. Should be still edible. Oh, it's a bit frozen. No worries. I can use my fire to heat it up. Are you hungry? I haven't seen you take a single bite. You can have these. I'm not hungry yet. Cherish every game. Okay, now we have to solve some puzzle. Now we'll have a boss fight. More tacit discords. I'll handle them. Okay. Embracing change. Obey. One with the sound. One more time. Ooh, what was that? Bad time. Fuck, 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 fuck. I can't do anything. Except losing my head. Keep it together. One with the sound. Shadow descends. You are history. You are our history. Your story is finished. Is this the key to that door? Yes. And those tacit discords just devoured the frequencies of the guard on door duty. <sighs> Cherish every game. I can't go there, but still, still, got I have to try. Okay, nothing is here. So. <sighs> it might look kind of scary, but actually, it doesn't hurt at all. Of course. I'm a resonator too, you know. My forte is a powerful one. I control fire. Nothing's brighter and warmer than fire. It can burn away the cold and drive away monsters. Th that's because I don't know how to properly control it yet. 
The resonator who taught me about my forte said, if I don't use it properly, I'll die young. They also said a lot of things I couldn't understand. Told me I shouldn't use it too often. But if I don't use my forte, I'd get eaten by the tacit discords or killed by the bad people. What's the point of living a longer life if I can't even survive? I want to live. I want to become a strong grown-up. I want to have good control of my power and protect the people who protected me in the past. And then... And then... I'll make a peaceful and prosperous world for everyone. Yes. According to the village teacher, that means children will no longer be in danger from monsters. We'll all have enough to eat and stable lives. But I've still got lots to learn. So, I'll need to find someone really strong and learn from them. Thank you. I want to become as strong as you are. I... I understand. I'll do my best. So what a strange place. So it's supposed to look familiar, but there are so many things I've never seen before. This door... I don't know why, but I keep getting the feeling that I've been here before. It's so weird. Let's look around. Maybe we'll find something. Does Changli still remember Rover like after seeing her? created inside this sonorosphere. As I stepped inside, both Rover and the Fraxidus vanished into thin air. The frequencies are constantly changing, and the flow of time is chaotic, just like it had been on Mount Firmament. A sonorosphere affected by temporal disruption. Once someone enters, there's risk of being stuck inside forever. And if my master had planned all of this, did he do this to mislead? To separate? Or perhaps... I should be careful. Whatever the case, I must find Rover first. Make it fast. I'm starving. Oh, this thing. Oh. If I burn it a bit with my fire, I can eat it, I guess.
I can do it. Yes. Back then, I didn't know how to control my flames. I couldn't even force my way out of it. My body was always covered in burns. Together we vanish. I... I didn't... Don't try to play me, you little thief. You think I'm buying this story? How the hell does a little homeless brat like you score all this food? This is our turf. Better scurry off if you know what's good for you. Why don't we let her stay? See, she's a... We've got plenty of mouths to feed already. Unless you're planning to have her eat from your plate, Maybe Rova has got to do something with that. Ma'am, are you okay? Oh, there's been a lot more tacit discords lately. I'm fine. Thank you for driving those monsters away. But, honey, these cuts and bruises all over you, some new and some old, they never seem to fully heal. I'm a resonator. These wounds are nothing. Oh, oh, honey. You shouldn't be trapped in this place like we are for the rest of your life. You should go to the city. With a powerful forte like yours, you'll surely find a wonderful future for yourself there. But, ma'am, what about you and the others? You go out there and make something of yourself. Make us proud. And when you're ready, come back for us. <laughs> what do you say, dear? And these. Take these with you on your way there. How do you like these? This place. This is where Master once lived in seclusion. The spaces are a jumbled mess inside this Sonarosphere. Okay, you cannot go anywhere else except just you can go far. Please, wait! <sighs> My dear, you've come all this way. What do you need from me? I... I am... Y you gave me some food before. I haven't thanked you yet. You misunderstood my intentions. When I sought shelter in your hideout during the rain, I gave you rations as a small token of thanks. No need to be troubled by it, little one. But... but you told me... 
The path to safety lies in embracing fortuitous moments. I didn't understand what you meant by that. Well, now, uh, I only said those words on a mere whim. Never expected you to remember them so clearly. I've heard Master Xuanmiao is a wise hermit guru who helps people. Can you, maybe, take me as your apprentice? I've been searching for you for so long. Please, will you consider it? I want to live. Learn to control my power and become stronger. Or I won't see a peaceful and prosperous world. Do you know what defines a peaceful and prosperous world? I think... I think it means people can take care of themselves and have a place to call home. Too. I have a strong forte. Look! Is this flame manipulation? Why can't I go anywhere else? I hate you, game. <sighs> Such a fearful power. If not used wisely, it may engulf you in return. Without proper guidance, you will eventually be reduced to ashes. Alas, perhaps this is fate. I can teach you how to control your power. But in this world of ups and downs, relying solely on brute force will not get you far. If you long for a peaceful and prosperous world, you must utilize your own intellect to choose, strategize, and shape the future you desire. Come over, child. You bear the powers of flame manipulation. A phoenix born from fire. One that shall bring peace to this world. From this day on, your name will be Chung Li. You have to go, Master. Oh, my time in this world is up, my child. I have my own destination to head to. I can only accompany you so far on this journey. Are you going to a dangerous place alone? Why can't I go with you? It's not your turn to go there yet, Chang Li. You are a very gifted child, and you will surely achieve greatness one day. But the price you pay for forcefully employing your forte can never be erased. Oh, your lifespan is doomed to be much shorter than that of ordinary people. Yes. I understand. Remember what I have taught you. Ponder carefully, plan meticulously, and shield yourself wisely. For when you have grown into the person you aspire to become, your impact on this world shall be great. Chang Li will remember your teachings by heart, Master. But Master, this person you want me to find, how should I find them? When the time comes, you will know, and you will have my aid. You need only use your wisdom to offer that person some 
Necessary guidance. She is the only one who can truly change this world. You must find and help her. This way, the world of prosperity you seek will soon be within reach. I believe I've found that person, Master. This Weiji board and the Sonoro Sphere. They are both a puzzle and an answer. The end of the Sonoro Sphere. Turns out it's exactly where she is. No, I'll not go there. I'll see. Why it is here? Make it fast. I go a little back. If I could find anything. Make it fast. No, we Make have only fast. one way to go. What is that drift snail is doing over there? But why can't we climb this tree? Okay, I have got some egg. I have got the drip smell. I have got whatever collectibles I had. Okay, so let's go to the side. I guess this is another riddle from my master. Okay, I need to make it fast. Those time thing, what are the Make it fast. Okay, I can do one thing. Yes. I... I'm 
Fine. I think I'm remembering something. But it's all just a blur. I can't make out any clear images. I've been looking for something for a long, long time. I don't know. I just remember that it's very, very important. Something that can change the world. But I'm starting to wonder why I'm even here. Everything looks so different from what I remember. And why do you look so familiar? We've never met before. <laughs> we might be able to open that door with it. What will we find behind that door? Yeah, I hope so. Cherish every game. A scheme might be grander than naught, vanquish malevolence in its nascent guise. Master? Chung Li, you have done well. Now that you have found the answers you seek, it is time to begin your journey. From this moment on, the choices you make and the plans you lay out they will all lead to that future. Sorry I kept you waiting. This place! It, it, it's a trap! They played us! Now the if big bat. Oh, level 55. No problem. Oh, 
Great job. Fury boils. Feel my wrath. None shall whisper. Take four. I wanted to absorb it. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck me. Don't worry. This game is almost over. Can you feel it? It's warm. Doesn't hurt at all. See? Finally, I think the mission is over. It was pretty in intense. The ending was really beautiful. Learning webs have set a new rank for gacha games. It's so beautiful. Oh, Wuli, this is the miracle we've been waiting to see. It's hope, reborn after destruction. Fooling. It's over. Did you find what you were looking for? Thank you for your help. The Midnight Rangers have successfully apprehended all remaining Fraxidus members in the mountains, and the effects of the temporal disruption have now vanished. I lost all contact with you during this whole time. Did you run into any trouble? Temporal disruption hidden inside a sonorosphere. It makes sense now why it stayed hidden for so long. I never thought the solution would be to burn down the entire sonorosphere from the inside. You went too far back there, Chang Li. I know my limits. Rover, Lady Chung Li. Wu Li is fine now, thanks to his doctor's help. As for me, well, at least I can still walk a bit. After all, it's been almost five days. I never properly thanked you for bringing me back to Hangzhen. I heard about the attack by the Fraxidus in the mountains. I... I'm so sorry. No need for that. I understand. 
The Fraxidus had their eyes on the same thing we did. They've been planning an ambush on us for a long time. Why would we blame it on you? We will never forget how you saved us. You gave us the opportunity to witness such a breathtaking sight. Thanks to your help, this journey holds no regrets for me. As for the truth behind the so-called secret of immortality, Fooling has told me everything. I had a gut feeling it would turn out to be a disappointment, but I couldn't give up. And in the end, I lost sight of why I even started this journey. But this isn't the first time this has happened. Let's just call it another adventure coming to an end. I've talked about it with Fooling. From now on, I'll take her on more trips to see more new places together. Until... <laughs> Until the day when I can no longer hold a pen. I've already talked to the folks at the publishing house, and they're happy to let me continue painting for them. My eventual departure may be unavoidable, but I want to give it my all until the very end. I know you have already looked past death, but remember, there are people who care about you. They want you to live on and be happy. Yes, I understand. Sometimes I wish we could stay together a little longer, if only for a while. Of course, fooling, I... We've always been... It's not time to be sad yet, is it? I've compiled a list of renowned doctors in Huanglong. They're highly skilled and may offer assistance for your medical condition, which is challenging but not impossible to cure. Lady Chengli, I, I truly can't thank you enough. No need for thanks. If you're feeling generous and want to repay me, I hope to see Fu Ling's work in the next issue of Artists of Huang Long. Everyone's been missing seeing their favorite landscape artists work lately. Are you surprised? Well, now I'm curious. What kind of a person do you see me as? Now that the situation has been resolved, you should return to Hong Zhen. You deserve some good rest. After going through so much, you must be exhausted, Rover. Me? Well, I think Lady Xing Yi could use the extra help in dealing with the aftermath. <laughs> well, it wouldn't hurt to have a little more faith in me. It's getting late. Maybe we should wait until we get back to discuss anything else. Two days have passed since Cheng Li told me she and Jin Yi would handle the aftermath. I wonder how she's doing. Are you worried? Let's just go ask her then. Uh, I don't know. So maybe this lesson will end over here. See where does it take us? How to get up?
Greet were almost done dealing with the aftermath of the previous incident. We're currently questioning the remaining Fraxidus members we caught at Mount Firmament. They wanted to get their hands on the temporal program from the legend of the Wei Qi game, with the intention of unleashing chaos in Mount Firmament once again. But thanks to you and Chang Li, their plans were foiled. Chang Li recounted to us that a Fraxidus overseer had entered the Sonora Sphere and was injured by her fire. They were lucky to escape, but have not been seen since. I've put together a thorough report for City Hall. We will strengthen our defences to make sure this doesn't happen again. We parted two days ago on the coast, and then she returned to Jinjo. Perhaps she's just taking some time to rest and recover. It must have taken a lot out of her to summon that much fire at once. Chang Li knew you'd be worried, and she wanted me to relay this message to you. Meet her at the pavilion on Mount Firmament. She'll be waiting for you there. She also said, no more riddles this time. So we go there. Okay, back at where we started. The same place we started from here. How are you feeling, Rover? Well rested, I hope. Aw, oh, can't you see I'm perfectly fine, sitting right in front of you? Don't worry, Rover. We're only having a casual conversation today. Nothing taxing. Besides, you only agreed to join me here for more questions, right? Oh, is that so? I'm curious then. Sure, ask away. I'm happy to answer them to the best of my ability. It all started a century ago, when my mentor, Master Xuanmiao, had a brief encounter with a certain peculiar visitor. During a TD outbreak, my master was rescued by that individual. She exuded a unique energy and was always elusive. My master dug through ancient texts and unearthed her presence in long-forgotten history. After searching for several years, he finally met that person on Mount Firmament again. They played a game of Weiji together, and that was how the legendary game record came into being. At first, I thought my master meant the game record held actual information about the time crisis, but that was just a clue. The real key was finding you, the person behind it all. And lastly, the secret of immortality it's most likely just the woodcutter's own spin on the tail. Sure, ask away. I'm happy to answer them to the best of my ability. My master and the mysterious visitor had set a trap with the Sonarosphere, using the Weichi game as a guise. They hid it with the Court of Savante's Chronos Orders, and it would only activate once the time flow on Mount Firmament was restored to its normal state. Despite the Sentinel and Mount Firmament being saved, the Fraxidus would not go down without a fight. They were convinced that the temporal mandate was hidden within the game of Weichi, but little did they know, they had already fallen into a trap. 
pure coincidence or the calculated workings of the Fraxidus, the explorer stumbled upon the Weichi board, setting off its defense mechanisms. The Sentinel was already damaged when it arrived here. My master had foreseen the disasters that would befall Mount Firmament, so he created this mechanism as a precautionary measure. The Sonorosphere would devour all who attempted to enter, unless they knew the solution to that puzzle. Precisely. The only way to escape was by burning the Sonorosphere without hurting anyone inside. It required masterful control of Forte. Thinking back, it was probably his ultimate test for me. That was his first goal with this Sonorosphere. Before leaving, Master entrusted me with a mission to find that individual, the one who played Weichi with him, the one who left behind that game record. After my master's passing, she would be the only one who could control the Sonorosphere. By now, you should know who she is. Yes. My master often mentioned you before his passing. And from the moment you arrived in Jinzhou, I had my suspicions about your true identity. Our journey to Mount Firmament solidified my beliefs. And finally, the Weichi board in that Sonorosphere sealed the truth for me. Sure, ask away. I'm happy to answer them to the best of my ability. Indeed, those memories, they were all real. Yes, that's all in the past. Just a little homeless girl with no name. I never thought we could make new memories in the Sonorosphere, where only the past repeats itself. A moment of companionship and protection meant everything to me. I can sense your unspoken question. Did I sacrifice my life when I burned down the Sonorosphere, like when I was a child? What I told you there was true, but I've grown and gained control over my powers. Using my forte now won't harm me in any way. Of that, you can rest assured. Also, if you really are the legendary person who changed the course of history, then you are perhaps the closest to immortality, aside from our sentinel. We mortals come and go. Our lives are full of meetings and goodbyes. Our time on this earth is fleeting compared to yours, so don't let it bother you. I see. Perhaps this is why it's so hard to leave this beautiful world behind. Then, would you be willing to finish that game of Weichi with me instead? The young orphan girl carried on. Everywhere she looked, tragedies rampant. As lament engulfed the globe, a world torn by monsters filled with homeless souls. With her own blood as fire, 
she drove away the cold. And her master said, In this tumultuous world, lives are fragile as mayflies. She couldn't exhaust herself to save those before her. But she must endure to ignite a brighter tomorrow. She wielded her wits to evade harm, treading on knives with care. Alone, yet maturing through stumbles. Later on, she became someone else's teacher. She taught the future leader this, to guide conscience and secure prosperity for the people, to continue lost teachings of past sages and establish peace for all. I will be the torchbearer, for one person can't rid the world of chaos alone. One day, a future of prosperity and lasting peace will arrive. Finally, this mission is over. Finally, finally, it's over. So, bye bye for now. We'll see you on the next stream.